Benjamin, that's my spot. You don't get to sit there. What's up guys? Welcome back to another part of Single Dad. What are you? I don't know what he's complaining about. Um, but we are going to come over here and just chat with Misty really quickly. We will ask her about her day, make a promise to protect her, give her a hug, and then we're going to send her home. And, oh my gosh, I really need to get a new mouse. My little, like, the thing in the middle that rotates your screen barely works anymore. I have to push it in really far. But anyways, then we're going to send her home, and we are going to go out with Miss LaToya, and we are going to break things off with her. Um, all right, so Misty, go home. Also, we're going to age Brownie into an adult dog today, which is really exciting. Um, I turned aging off. I don't know why. Hopefully, that'll fix itself in a minute. But we're going to go ahead and invite her out. I want to go somewhere that is very a public place. Um, I don't know what time those places open, so maybe we'll go to... We'll go here, meet her there, and we are going to end things with her just because I believe it was two parts ago, you know, LaToya came over one day and her and Misty got in a fight and it caused Hiram and Misty to argue with each other and um, that's why Hiram kind of took Misty to this resort and was like, hey, you know, how do you really feel about her, blah, 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 and it just... You know, he came to the realization that if my daughter doesn't like someone, then I can't be with her because my daughter is the most important thing to me. So, okay, I just, I'm really hoping that shuts off because I keep forgetting to turn aging off a lot of the times when I um, switch over to the save file. So I'm afraid like they're going to age up when I don't want them to. <laughs> All right, come on. Okay, let me just make sure. I know I just did it like literally on screen, but I just want to make sure because I'm like, I'm nervous. Okay, yeah, so aging is turned off. <clears throat> okay, Latoya's already here. How scary. I would, oh, and my friend just showed up, so I can no longer film. I'm going to pick this back up, hopefully when she leaves, but knowing me, probably in three days. See you guys then. Woo, what happened? All right. Okay, guys. So I am back. It is the next day like I thought it would be. Also, I do want to say really quickly, I am in the middle of cooking. So every couple minutes, I'm going to have to like step away and flip my chicken because that's what I'm cooking. So I apologize for that. But this is like the only time I have to film this week. So we are here with LaToya. And I think we, we're not even going to try and sugarcoat it. We are just going to... Um, I don't want to like I think we're just gonna basically be like we'll be mock her snobbiness and basically just be like look you know my daughter doesn't like you she thinks you're a snob like she just really is not happy with us being together so we need to break up look at her she's like excuse the fuck out of me oh look at him he's like girl I don't care about you like for real and oh no <laughs> I literally tell them to break up and then I'm like, oh no, they're breaking up, what? I'm so dramatic. Oh, his first breakup. It's so sad. And now he's sad because he lost a friend. It was a tough time, but Hiram just broke up with LaToya. He'll always remember the moment that he decided enough was enough and brought that miserable relationship to an end. Poor LaToya. I really want to ask her, I think we have to wait a little bit, but I want to ask her to like just be friends so we can still have her as a friend for this because we currently have one friend. So uh, yeah, that's Nigel. So what I think we're going to do is we're going to chat it up with this Leah girl and just try to be friends with her. Actually, I think we're going to just chat with a bunch of people and just try to like build our friendships and stuff and hopefully one day we can you know still be friends with LaToya and still meet a compatible sim of course we will so while he's doing that I'm gonna jump back over to Misty and Brownie and it's actually sorry my dog just made a weird noise I thought he was throwing up but he 
I don't know what he did, but he didn't throw up. Um, we're actually going to age Brownie into an adult dog today, but really quickly, I would like him to eat first because he's starving. Okay, go ahead and answer your phone. Brownie, you can come eat. Um, oh, it's Colette. Do you want to hang out? Yes, Colette is coming over. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Okay, so let's see. Let oh, She really can't put the toys away. That's annoying. Oh, also, <laughs> look what Brownie did. That beach. We're going to replace that. Girl, don't see. Oh, actually, you do need to do your homework. Just wait for Colette to get here, actually. <clears throat> um, we are also going to give Brownie some attention before we age him up, just because I don't want him to age up with a really low social bar. Okay, that's enough. That's fine. Um, hopefully, uh, Colette shows up soon. And then, yeah, I'm just going to have him chat with a bunch of people. I really want him to uh, get more friends because he needs at least three before he can improve before he can improve his charisma. Sorry, that was like barely English. Um, but yeah, he needs at least three before he can improve his charisma skills. So I would just <laughs> like to hurry that along. Ugh, I cannot talk today. I'm like choking on my words. Okay, give him smoochies and then maybe talk to him. Oh, my dog found his squeaker toy. I love that. Okay, actually, let's go ahead and put him down. And we are going to age him up. I guess Colette is not coming over. I swear I said at my place, but oh, there's my timer. Gotta go flip my chicken. I'll be right back. Okay, it definitely did not need to be flipped. I have it on really low heat. So instead of setting a timer and leaving every five minutes, I'm just gonna let it go and hope that I don't burn it. But I'm gonna go ahead and turn on testing cheats enabled true. And we are going to trigger age transition. And we're going to age Brownie into an adult puppy. I'm so excited. An adult puppy. That made so much sense. How's he doing? Okay, he's got a long line of, long line of chatting to do. Um, oh, they're no longer checked in. That's fine. I figured they weren't anyways. We'll go ahead and answer the phone again, I guess. Oh, look at those ears. Oh, my God. Look at those ears. Oh my god, I have never been more in love with a dog ever. <gasps> Look at those freaking ears. Um, Colette would like to chat. Okay, sure. Alright, you can finish eating. Get yourself super, super full. And I'm also going to have you come grab a toy to get your destruction up. Brownie can finally start going up and down stairs. We can get a ball for hi him. Him? Yeah, we can get a ball for him to go play outside with. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. We are going to go rub his belly and brush him. And <clears throat> we can't train him until we're a teenager, but we're going to go for a walk to the dog park. Uh, I have no idea how far away that is, but we'll see if we... Oh, it's actually not too far. I mean, the cat park is way closer, but yeah, it's actually not too far at all see how he's doing he still has quite a long line oh and he's getting cold I'm gonna send him home actually and yeah I'll let him finish those few chats and then I'll send him home look at how cute this is oh my god brownie I love brownie oh her little laugh it's kind of creepy but it's also really cute I love them. This was the best decision ever, letting her get a dog. Oh, Brownie. Okay, I'm going to get a few, not a few things, literally just one thing. Um, we don't have a, where am I, what am I doing here? <clears throat> we don't have a very big yard for Brownie to play in, so we can't get like a, um, what is that called? a dog house we can't get a dog house but we can get a little ball he can like push that around back and forth and stuff like that but she really I'm actually gonna have her eat her last piece of candy and then do her homework and I'm gonna put these comic books in here because I'm kind of tired of them being in her inventory and then just kind of you know get herself ready for the night it is three o'clock so she does need to get working on her homework and stuff because <clears throat> she does have school what is this Oh my god, I had them go for a walk. Okay, sorry. <laughs> We're gonna have to do that some other day. 
Uh, Brownie, you come outside and chase your ball. He wants to warm up. Oh, bud. I'm sorry. <laughs> I hate that eating the candy doesn't get their, like, hunger up. Even a li It should go up a little bit, you know? It just literally gives him a moodlet, and that's it, which is honestly kind of annoying, but also, like, makes sense, you know? I love how she has a good relationship with, I was going to say everyone, but, like, most people. <laughs> most people she has a good relationship with. Who is this girl? Danielle. Hmm. Okay, so we can build our friendship with these two guys at work. We already have a good friendship with our boss. Oh my god, we're friends with Leah. That's amazing. So now we have two friends. And then once this goes away, this lost a friend moodlet, we can talk to LaToya again, ask her to just be friends, and then this will change from ex-girlfriend to friend. So that'll help us out. That'll give us another one. And I really think that he would still want to be friends with her. You know what I mean? Like, <clears throat> I know some people might find this weird, but, like, my mom is still really good friends with some of her exes, and I literally don't have an ex. Like, my boyfriend is the only person I've ever dated, but guys that I've, like, talked to in the past, I'm still, like, I'm not, like, friends with them, but, like, I'm civil with them. So I feel like Hiram would be like that with LaToya, you know, because he did love her, and he did really want to be with her, but Misty comes first. Also, sorry if you guys think that's cheating what I just did putting the or throwing that stuff away for him but it needed to be done okay and then when he gets home we're gonna go ahead and grab the mail and then we are gonna make some grilled cheese for him and Misty hopefully he will be home soon because he is getting really really gold oh and she's already done with her homework wow go ahead and play with your dollhouse like a brownie out here playing with her his ball Oh, oh, what happened? What the freak happened? I want a picture. Bark at it. That's that's how you play with a ball. Oh, it's adorable. I love it. I freaking love it. Um, okay, you just need to come home. Like, just get over here, pay these bills, make some dinner. It's already 6 o'clock, and Missy has been home alone, like, all day. <clears throat> Also, this house kind of needs to be cleaned again. Like, the shower needs clean, the toilet needs cleaned. I'm sure the sink's going to need cleaned after this. I guess not, but you know what I mean. All right, Hiram. Hopefully, standing above the stove, or like by the stove, will warm you up a little bit. Oh, I cannot get over how freaking adorable Brownie is. Uh, it's my boyfriend calling again. Hold on, guys. Okay, hopefully, that is the last interruption of the night. Hey, there's a letter for Hiram from Leah. It says, I know this is coming out of nowhere, but I think you should take a chance on me. I'm a lot of fun, and I think we'd be great together. <gasps> oh my god, you guys, that is perfect, because that's, I'm sure you all knew, but that's who I wanted. <gasps> okay, so I think what we're going to have to do is, he does work tomorrow, but after work, I think he's going to go out with Leah kind of do like a little tester day. I don't think he's the kind of person to jump right into another relationship as soon as one ends. I definitely think he would wait at least until his lost a friend moodlet is gone. But, oh, that's kind of exciting. That's actually really exciting. I don't know why I'm saying kind of. Like, that's exciting. Set wash type. Normal delicate. Okay. <clears throat> but that's really exciting because I'm sure you all knew already. But Leah was the next girl I wanted him to date. Um, so, yeah, I'm really excited. Okay, fill the bowl. I know you don't need to, but we're just kind of... Oh, he burnt it. He burnt the crap out of it. Oh, my gosh. Anyways, they are going to eat their dinner together. He can eat his food in his food bowl. Just because they can all kind of eat together. Cute, cute, cute. Um, and then Hiram is going to kind of... Oh my god, can I click on the sink, please? Or is that not a possibility? Um, Hiram is going to clean the house a little bit. Oh, okay. Um, do laundry. Is there any laundry to grab? No, there's not. Okay, perfect. And again, I'm going to have Missy do the dishes because, like I said, um, she is old enough to do a little bit of cleaning around the house. Like, I don't think Hiram would expect her to be scrubbing toilets, but... Doing her own dishes is probably something that he wants her to do. And he freaking clogged the toilet. Love that. 
unclog it, you little nasty beach. Um, and then I'm going to have her come in here and go for a joyride until it's time for bed. Just because I feel like she never spends any time in her room. And honestly, as a kid, I spent so much time in my room. Also, um, I am going to keep this picture of him and Latoya up just for a little bit. Because, like, I, like I've been saying this whole time, you know, he still loves her. He's just putting the needs of his daughter first. Um... So he's, he is heartbroken from the breakup, just, you know, maybe not as much as Latoya, because she definitely didn't see it coming. <clears throat> and that's why I don't think he's going to start dating anyone, like, right away, because I don't think that's him, you know? And I'm going to have our dog come inside, because I can hear zombies out there, and I don't like it. So please come inside, Brownie, for real. I don't want you to be outside with them. Who is this? Oh, I forgot. That stupid mountain, so I have to switch my camera angles. Okay. Okay, you're annoying. I really should turn off zombies unless I have a Supernatural Let's Play, which I already did Supernatural, so it's not like I have to worry about that. So I should really turn zombies off, but it's not something I don't ever think about, you know? But I think he's just... Oh, I hate when they freaking do this. And then puts it on the floor. What a beach. Okay, we're going to do the laundry again, since he doesn't feel the need to actually do it. And then I think he's just going to head off to bed, so I'm going to go ahead and end this part here. Oh, look at Brownie, sitting like such a good boy. Oh my god. My dog's probably like, who the hell is Brownie and why is he a gooder boy than me? <laughs> oh, he's so freaking cute, but I'm going to go ahead and end this part here. I hope you guys all enjoyed. Um, I think if everything goes as planned, I'm going to film the next part, like, right away. Or not right away, but I'm going to film the next part next, so that should be the next video out. So make sure you guys like and comment and subscribe so you see the next part as soon as it's out, as soon as it's posted. That's what I used to say in every video. See the next part as soon as it's posted, and I will see all of your lovely faces in my next video. Bye, guys!